The Josephson effect is the phenomenon of supercurrent, i.e., a current that flows indefinitely long without any voltage applied, across a device known as a Josephson junction, which consists of two superconductors coupled by a weak link. The weak link can consist of a thin insulating barrier, a short section of non-superconducting metal, or a physical constriction that weakens the superconductivity at the point of contact. The Josephson effect is an example of a macroscopic quantum phenomenon. It is named after the British physicist Brian David Josephson, who predicted in 1962 the mathematical relationships for the current and voltage across the weak link. The DC Josephson effect had been seen in experiments prior to 1962, but had been attributed to super shorts or breaches in the insulating barrier leading to the direct conduction of electrons between the superconductors. The first paper to claim the discovery of Josephson's effect and to make the requisite experimental checks was that of Philip Anderson and John Rowell. These authors were awarded patents on the effects that were never enforced, but never challenged. Before Josephson's prediction, it was only known that normal electrons can flow through an insulating barrier, by means of quantum tunneling. Josephson was the first to predict the tunneling of superconducting Cooper pairs. For this work, Josephson received the Nobel Prize in Physics in 1973. The NIST standard for 1 volt is achieved by an array of 19,000 Josephson junctions in series. A Dayum bridge is a thin film variant of the Josephson junction in which the weak link consists of a superconducting wire with dimensions on the scale of a few micrometers or less. The effect the basic equations governing the dynamics of the Josephson effect are where you and I are the voltage and current across the Josephson junction, is the phase difference across the junction, and IC is a constant, the critical current of the junction. The critical current is an important phenomenological parameter of the device that can be affected by temperature as well as by an applied magnetic field. The physical constant is the magnetic flux quantum, the inverse of which is the Josephson constant. The three main effects predicted by Josephson follow from these relations. The DC-Josephson effect The DC-Josephson effect is a direct current crossing the insulator in the absence of any external electromagnetic field, owing to tunneling. This DC-Josephson current is proportional to the sign of the phase difference across the insulator, and may take values between in the AC-Josephson effect with a fixed voltage across the junctions. The phase will vary linearly with time and the current will be an AC current with amplitude and frequency. The complete expression for the current drive becomes this means a Josephson junction can act as a perfect voltage to frequency converter. The inverse AC Josephson effect if the phase takes the form, the voltage and current will be the DC components will then be hence. For distinct AC voltages, the junction may carry a DC current and the junction acts like a perfect frequency to voltage converter. Applications the Josephson effect has found wide usage, for example in the following areas. Squids, or superconducting quantum interference devices, are very sensitive magnetometers that operate via the Josephson effect. They are widely used in science and engineering. In precision metrology, the Josephson effect provides an exactly reproducible conversion between frequency and voltage. Since the frequency is already defined precisely and practically by the cesium standard, the Josephson effect is used, for most practical purposes, to give the standard representation of a volt, the Josephson voltage standard. However, BIPM has not changed the official SI unit definition. Single electron transistors are often constructed of superconducting materials allowing news to be made of the Josephson effect to achieve novel effects. The resulting device is called the superconducting single electron transistor. The Josephson effect is also used for the most precise measurements of elementary charge in terms of the Josephson constant and von Klitzing constant which is related to the quantum Hall effect. RSFQ Digital Electronics is based on shunted Josephson junctions. 
In this case, the junction switching event is associated to the emission of one magnetic flux quantum that carries the digital information. The absence of switching is equivalent to zero, while one switching event carries a one. Josephson junctions are integral in superconducting quantum computing as qubits such as in a flux qubit or other schemes where the phase and charge act as the conjugate variables. Superconducting tunnel junction detectors may become a viable replacement for CCDs for use in astronomy and astrophysics in a few years. These devices are effective across a wide spectrum from ultraviolet to infrared, and also in X-rays. The technology has been tried out on the William Herschel telescope in the SCAM instrument, Queterans and similar superconducting switching devices. Josephson effect has also been observed in Sheckwood's, the superfluid helium analog of a DC squid.